I just want to just like brush her because like I said originally we we're supposed to have everything supposed to go and now it's like okay here's all the stuff not supposed to go so I'm kind of I don't I don't know what to do I just don't want to spend a lot of time like I said because like I guess I got so much to do I don't really when people call me I never know what I'm gonna see never know what I'm gonna find and like right here I found this and then I found the original box put them together. And that's what a hoarders do. They hoard everything. And this guy loved hoarding brand. All right, in this video, we go to a hoarder's house. The gentleman and wife are still alive. They moved out of the house. The guy that I'm dealing with is hired to clean the house, but he didn't want to throw everything out. That's why he hired us. And there's a little issue they left the list of stuff to hoarders. Now, hoarders want to hoard, okay? Their other house is packed full. There's no room there. They have a storage unit packed full. But once again, this is what hoarders do. And they're trying to keep as much as possible. And the guy's saying, you don't have anywhere to put it. I get a little upset in the video. Watch the video. Take a look. And you won't believe, believe what this person hoarded. Unbelievable. Appreciate y'all watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share with your friends. Hey, how we doing, Robert? Good, how you doing? I'm trying to get some of these. These are all tools too that I think you'd be able to auction. All right. This is all hell. Look at here. All brand new shit. All brand new pipe cutter. And all bits and stuff. Yeah, that's a, not a beautiful day. <laughs> I moved one bag over here and a tote, and it's like now the avalanche is starting to come down. But can you give some direction with how to do this, what you're doing? Well, the question do you have a place you want to put garbage somewhere? Well, that's what we got a garbage bag. <laughs> yeah. And just then I can to... just throw that out in the back of your truck. What do yep. you think? As yep. much yep. as I'll you can. I'll take it back with me because it's home with me. Get or recycle, like, I mean, all this stuff here, you know? All these containers, like clear off this table. I'll give it somewhere to start. Okay. So, um, Are you gonna sell those? No. You gotta, All the plastic stuff costs. I mean, unless it's something special. Like a lot of this stuff is like dirty or missing lids. Yes. And, uh, no, I'm good with that. I just want to. Or you can whatever you want to do with it. Over here this whole bag of coffee cups. Yeah. You, I don't want anything to do it. You don't want anything to do with it. No. You, you sell all this stuff, don't you, Robert? I sell some of it. Yeah, put in lots of stuff. Yeah, I. showed up here and that uh and there's a battery charger on them there's a battery charge sitting in the middle of the driveway <laughs> was it hooked right, up to the car no that. just sitting in the middle of the driveway well maybe someone's trying to steal the battery charger yeah, some of this stuff you guys can take it to the strap or something Dave, you want any of these newer things saved if not i'm tossing them if you don't want them to... i don't want them but i don't want to make the message how heavy do you want to make the bag um, I'm going to sit outside. Well, how heavy you want to get it? This makes it nicer just to have. Give me that bag. It's too cold. It's too cold. Yeah, that's the brand new stuff. Right now, put them this side. We can, I mean, you guys can strap them, we can strap them something. Okay. This is a lid, we might be able to find a lot of work, you know. Sunglasses, thanks. Awesome. They look like it's not anything. Yeah, they're probably marks 199 This could work charming. Oh, 
other stuff. Put the cleaner stuff in the box. Tools, vices, and bags. The whole thing's all tools here. They're still here. I don't think he even knows what tools he's looking for. I've already got over here like about five bags in a box. Full of okay, I want to tell them I was going to be in this one. It was a box. Vice and place is in the flight of the eagle. A lot more these bags. Very cool. Taking the tools, they're not taking the tools. Um, yeah, some of the tools. Mo, what do you think? I, I'm, uh, he, some, can't, he can't possibly use all of it. I say we've got a stack of several here. Okay, yeah, I mean, give us what some tools. I, I mean, if you leave all the tools, you're probably going to have half a house. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there's I, a whole toolbox. Maybe yeah, there's like a toolbox inside. Both got a spot in there. Is it was like everything goes, you know what I'm saying? Right, that's what I mean when they keep, it's like, we just want to do this. We just wanted the trashers and auction. <laughs> right. We set this aside, that's got to be on it. What do you got? Kevin, got it. But there's a brand new, you haven't even had out a box. You can't make it good one. Well, can you give me another trash bag? Yep. The worst of the trash Like frustrated because, like I said, originally we we're supposed to everything supposed to go, and now it's like, okay, here's all the stuff not supposed to go. So I'm kind of, I don't, I don't know what to do. I just don't want to spend a lot of time. No, going through, I get, I get going you. through. And like I said, because like I guess I got so much to do, I don't really. So I just don't. Know. It just you frustrates are. me because originally, like we, we talked about, it's like, okay, Rob, everything's going in the house except for this patio furniture and stuff, and now it's like. This well, don't want to go, this don't want to go, this don't want to go, this one to go. Like, they, they've added to it, but... I right. mean, well, one, it says tools, and half the house is tools, so I, know, I don't want to get into like, an, an art, you know what I'm saying, with these people, get them all mad at me. Yeah, no. Well, but, uh, well, but they were told that best as possible, we would save some tools back. Yeah. See, this is a list they sent you, and it's like right here, yeah. it says tools. Yeah. And I'm like, well, I, if it says tools, vices, and bags, I mean, that's like half the... Yeah, know. that's half the... No, right, I don't know. I just... I said, I don't want to be taking stuff and never get mad at me. Yeah, nope. I'll make some decision for them. I'm like, this shit's all going to go. And I'll take the blame for it. I have no idea. Whatever it was with Greg, leave the... Yeah, I just don't want to get... No, I need it. You know what I'm saying? I want to make sure. Yeah, no, Do you have any doubts? Throw it down here and I'll look at it. Because, Mo, don't you have several bags of... Tools set aside for him. I've got like four bags in a box over here. And then he's got a couple bags set over here. I still want to get upset. That stuff. Yeah. I know sometimes people get really mad, especially in this because these are people that really like it. Well, and the wife was saying, we don't even have any room to bring them. CD holder like that. I got the stairwell cleared, at least we can get it in the door. <laughs> Gutter, you take them? Okay, so there's like yeah, they're brand new. I know, the problem is you got this money. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah. going to cover one gutter. And he said, you know what I'm saying? That's the problem. It's like, it, it was sold for four bucks. Right. And auctions were maybe two dollars. And if that, but no, you say they probably won't sell because you only got that many feet. Left and made, you would find more. Yeah, that's the thing that says the size. And the it's just like flooring and things like that, it's just so hard to sell if you don't got like a lot. This looks like new, all what? New wheels in there and trim. Okay. Good stuff, right? Yeah. What's your so this good? Is sellable. Yeah, like that stuff there. This is sellable? Oh, no. What's this thing? Like this thing. 
somebody they're good, but you know, if you need them, you know, they're awesome. Awesome. I saw big toast. Like this. All good. Fishing poles. Right. Well, there's something about fishing poles, more. No, he wanted the ones in the attic. He wanted some lures. Some lures in the attic. Not worth much. Not for me to sell. Huh? Not worth enough for me. Those are staying. Yeah, they're all. Those, yeah. This stuff we're pine by the door, it's all good. We should have told you that. This stuff right here is gone. This is blue tote. That stuff's gone. Plumbing stuff. Little videos, these are cool. Bill organizers. Transistor radios, these are cool. Milwaukee box. Just missed this tool. <laughs> no good. I took the table and chairs, but like this piece is not. Like, they, they, hopefully, they take the coffee or the tiny thing. 
don't know. I have to look at it. It's the furniture is one of those weird markets. It's yep. like the newer generation don't want half them stuff. They don't care. They don't. To them, it's all garbage. You want to believe how many people call me up just because their kids are going to throw everything out? Yeah. This is all clothes. It's like brand new car stuff you save. Out of it going. These are all shabby. Yeah, we'll take some of it. Yeah. I'm not very comfortable with your box a lot. I don't know how you do your auctions. I got a box full of light bulbs. Can I send them with you? Like I said, we can take some of them, but. Dusty, dusty. It's a dusty silver plate. How about stolen stuff? The ribbon, you know, cool radio. Junk or good? Good. Corn and uh, radio anymore. I'll take it a pass. Huh? So those old boom boxes and stuff, people, they like them for decorative stuff. They put them on shelves. Oh, I forgot what these things are for. They're like. What the heck are these things for? You can scrap it, but it's like heating. Right? Yeah, you put them in a cup of water or something. It'd burn your house down. It'd burn your house down. They're super old ones or something. Well, that's almost good enough. Huh? No. Nah. No. They're cool, but they have like design on them. They're new with some ones. Covered. No. In this day and age, no one uses those anymore. Yeah, a car collector case and it has like a label maker in there. <laughs>
So what did the hoarder hoard? Well, you won't believe it. Start looking right here. We took all this out of the hoarder house. Unbelievable. Brand new. Everything you could imagine. Tool-wise, extension cords, saw blades. I mean, desoldering tools, sockets, even some tumblers. But, I mean, this is just all brand new stuff. A lot of it's 10 years old. Boots, duck boots, toolboxes, extension cords, coasters. I mean, husky tools, husky tools. This all came from the hoarder house. Brand new, brand new. I mean, it's just unbelievable. Look at these vintage phones. And I know the colors will make them sell. Brand new screwdrivers. Ryobi stuff. Look at this Space Jam thing right here. Just some crazy, crazy stuff. Tools underneath the tables. All brand new. I mean, look at it right here. Craftsman. Carry all. It's probably 10, 15 years old. Still brand new in the box. I mean, this guy hoarded, 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 and just stacked up all brand new stuff. And this is just the beginning. And look at this. I mean... We have everything from CBs, brand new Dremel. There's bit sets and screwdrivers and more Husky. I mean, all brand new tools. He'd buy toolboxes and then put the tools in the toolboxes. It's just ridiculous. I mean, look at this brand new Craftsman, brand new crescent wrench there. Ace tools, pocket sockets, brand new multi-plugs. I mean, NASCAR, drill attachments. On and on and on. Brand new stuff. Piled up. There was some vintage stuff. Some Cleveland Indians and Brown stuff that we took. But, I mean, toolboxes and Black and Decker. I mean, it's just ridiculous. All this stuff. The hoarder bought. Brand new. Just put it away. Look at these opera glasses right there. American Vermont, you know, wheels. I mean, it's just unbelievable and the hoarder hoarded this stuff brand new stuff put it aside i mean we had things like knives brand new staple guns nuts bolts screws screw bits driver i mean it's just oh so much stuff then check out this awesome cool radio and then i found the original box for the radio. I mean, it's just crazy. Sprayers, all brand new, never used. He hoarded this kind of stuff. Why? Never used it. Piled, piled, piled. Living room, kitchen, basement, bedrooms, stairwells, attic. All this stuff piled up. I mean, there's a brand new flare gun. Another 40 piece socket set. Brand new hospital booze dispenser. That's that's one's funny. Brand new air deflectors. You know, pipe cutters. Underneath the table. Brand new. Brand new. Brand new. Outdoor lighting by Toru. Unbelievable. And this is not even the tip of the iceberg. Where do you see this? Right there. Brand new workbench. Brinks. Brand new tool sets. Toaster oven, brand new. I mean, look at this. Five-speed drill press, Black & Decker, brand new. This is what the guy hoarded, never used. I mean, look at the picture of this guy in there. He's probably 15, 20 years old. Who knows how much he paid for it, just sat in the basement. Light bulbs, oh my gosh. We have boxes full of brand new light bulbs. Toolboxes, 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 all brand new. You buy brand new toolboxes, put brand new tools in them. Look at this. You never know when you're going to need that. Brand new. Two faucets right here. Brand new. Delta and a mowing. I mean, ratchet straps. Just <laughs> It just kills me. I mean, look at these channel locks right here. Pry bar sets. Look at this. Pipe wrenches. All brand new stuff. Toolboxes, toolboxes. And the toolboxes are full of brand new tools. Saw blades down there. 
Husky, brand new bag. Look at the plastic still on it. And this guy just on and on and on. I mean, look at all these toilet valves. I mean, just brand new. How many are you going to need? You only have two toilets in the house, and you're not even going to use the toilets because they're full of junk. More pry bars. All brand new. Wall mounted drawers, you know, brand new. Ceiling fan, brand new. All this came from the hoarder house. These records we got from the hoarder house. But there's so much stuff that was just brand new. Tools, old stock. I mean, look at all these wiper blades. <laughs> this is what we're dealing with, ladies and gentlemen. Outdoor cutting equipment and pruners and drywall stuff and tile stuff and umbrellas and brand new Makita sander. Once again, brand new, brand new, brand new, brand new, brand new. I know, it's like a dead horse. It's just, this is what the hoarder, every hoarder is different. This one was all about brand new tools, brand new, brand new. And look at all these tables just loaded with their hoard. And it's just unbelievable. And I wish I could tell you it's over, but no, it keeps going and going and going. All brand new stuff. I mean, look at this Husky, Durbilt. Black and Decker, Bryobi, Popular Mechanic, you know, like I said, toolboxes, all brand new. And that's why I love my job. When people call me, I never know what I'm going to see, never know what I'm going to find. And like right here, I found this, and then I found the original box, put them together. And that's what a hoarders do. They hoard everything and this guy loved hoarding brand new tools. I appreciate you guys all watching. Don't forget, hit that thumbs up, subscribe, and like. You never know what you're going to see, and you never know what a hoarder is going to hoard. And this guy hoarded brand new tools worth lots and lots of cash. And now it's my turn to sell them.